this is going to be quite a chill out video i want it to be anyway i've got some new items that have arrived i've got one well i've got some new bags and they've just arrived and i'm really excited to try them out and i'm going to try them on with the outfits that i've bought as well and just see what i think of each one one of them i also bought and it was like it was 30 or 40 percent off i can't remember exactly it was either 30 or it was 40 it was definitely no more or no less than that so the first outfit i'm wearing it here as i talk i'll give you some proper close-ups of it um because that's always tricky while i'm talking to be able to get the camera right the top and the trousers so i wanted i've got one pair of khaki trousers that are two or three years old now love them to death i will never get get rid of them i feel like when you've got just one pair of khaki trousers they kind of um or kind of car cargo pants i think with them they are the kind of thing that once you've bought them you don't ever have to get rid of them and unless they wear out or break you don't ever really have to get anything new and with those particular ones, they are dry clean only. And I love them. And they look no different to the khaki trousers I'm wearing here. A absolutely no different. It's just the, the material texture is different. They're a pair of trousers that I wear particularly a lot in the summer because they're loose fit, but I also like the way they're high waisted and they're quite tight on the waist. And I wanted to get another pair for when they're at the cleaners. I happened to see these and I thought they looked very similar. Now they've turned up, I actually think they are pretty similar. And they're machine washable. So, you know it's perfect really. Then I've got a couple of tops which I anticipate wearing with this in different ways. Now before I move on to the tops, let me just show the bags. I'm actually gonna, which one should I do first? Um, I'll come on to the one which was 30 or 40% off in a second. This is the first, and I got this with a view to them matching the mules really perfectly. These mules are so comfortable. I, I like mules, but I try and not spend too much money on them because they're a shoe that you can't drive in. Um, I like the look of them, and I like the look of them for summer, but I didn't want to spend a load of money. And when I saw these, I thought, well, this is kind of perfect for what I would typically wear them for. They haven't cost me loads of money, so if I don't wear them on a daily basis and you know in terms of that kind of cost per wear thing it doesn't really matter but this bag I wanted to go with these shoes and I particularly wanted to tie the khaki colored trousers in because I found this with my other ones I remember when I bought those trousers I thought I'm never going to be able to pair them with lots of things I bet I'm going to have to go either black or white on the top but actually you can put color in and I've done it with those this bag is from Mansfield Gavriel there might be money off this at the moment kind of at the moment because of covid there are some major sales going on and when i bought all of these there was definitely big money off a valentino bag that i'm going to show you in a second there was also money off all of the clothes all of the clothes were 30 percent off can't remember whether this had a discount on it might have done if there is i will let you know but it's worth you checking anyway because at the time of doing this video it might be that there is no coupon but then you might check when this video goes live and there is one i've had this bag before i had it in black i sold it and i regretted selling it immediately because i it's a good utility bag you can fit a bottle of water in it standing up um kind of up ways it holds its shape so when you kind of squeeze it it doesn't the base doesn't go soggy on it at all it's got a nice adjustable shoulder strap. You can't remove this. It is the kind of strap where you either wear it on one shoulder or across the body. It's really lightweight, but it looks really nice. And if you're someone who wants a quality leather bag and you don't want a big logo across the front of it, this is a good one to go with. And I really like the look of it with these shoes. I might change the top to sh before I show you the second. And I'm gonna show you that bag that I told you about that was in the sale. This top is a, a knit kind of top. I'm gonna to put the details of it actually because I'm pretty sure this isn't kind of one of those acrylic plastic polyester mixes. It might have polyester in it. I can't be sure of that, but it doesn't feel like that kind of, you know, that fake wool, <laughs> which looks like wool, but it's actually not. This is, this is nice. I'm, so this is the bag I was telling you about. This, 
was the one that was 30 or 40 percent off and out of all of the bags I feel that because of the discount that you could get on this at the time, this also comes in a really pale pink and I think that colour is called Rose Quartz, but it's Valentino, it's a little bucket bag. You might possibly see this already because I'm going to, I'm doing a whole other video on bucket bags and I actually bought quite a few bucket bags at the time of buying this and that video I might put it out before this one so you might have already seen this. It comes with the, the handle is detachable but it also comes with a chain crossbody so you can either ditch the crossbody strap and just hold it kind of like this or by the top bit and you can also apply the chain to it now the good thing is with these bags what i like about them is the chain's been designed where you pin it on these loops behind this loop where the handle is and it's done it's done so that when you carry the bag the handle deliberately kind of flops over in that in that way i didn't realize that i've already got a rock stud flat bag and at one point the handle was upright and one of you wrote to me and you were like you've got that chain handle on wrong and i'm really glad you told me at the moment another reason why i'm really liking bucket bags is first of all i find that they're very timeless the actual overall shape of them but they are so convenient when it comes to getting stuff in and out of them. But I'm also really liking them for when I go to the supermarket. Bags like my Lady Dior's, I haven't actually used them except for that the mini one. I haven't really used them in months because they're bags that I used to use when I was going out in the day and I wanted to carry slightly more around with me. Now, because I'm not going out and when I am, it's to the supermarket and I don't need that much. This is perfect because I can go around I'm not touching it or having to hold it and just wear it crossbody. This was the plan with it. And with this other bucket bag I've got, which is from Gucci, it's brilliant and it's canvas, so I can wipe it clean after, it's fantastic. But this, yeah, I think out of everything, this is probably the best thing that's worth getting because of that discount. Um, and then the final item is, do I have any more bags? I do have some more bags, but I think they're the main three that I'm gonna show you. I've got one linen dress, haven't tried it on, don't know if it's going to fit, but I'm, I'll give it a go, let me just step behind you, it comes with a belt, but I don't actually like the belt, I'm going to put it on briefly though, so that you can see what it's like with the belt that actually comes with it. So this dress, I think I said, this dress is linen which is exactly what I kind of wanted for this time of year where it's kind of warm. And yeah, I like it. Do you know another reason why I got this? Because the idea I had in my mind is I can wear this with sneakers. I'm gonna show you here what the, the pair of shoes that I'm planning on wearing this with. These shoes, oh, I've gotta tell you, they are Oh, they're a bit dirty now. I can't stop wearing them. They're so comfortable. They're, they're the kind of shoe that's comfortable the minute you take it out of the box. Most shoes you kind of have to wear a bit for them to wear in, but these are comfortable. And I really like the, just the clean lines of them. I actually need to clean them because they've got scuffs on. I also do like this Prada one. This Prada bag's really nice, isn't it? And... Also, so if I get rid of this belt, here, here was the idea that I had. So I kind of, I knew it came with a belt, but I didn't necessarily think that belt was gonna be that amazing. And I thought I'd try that. Do you remember I said to you about the extra large Valentino belt? I thought I'm gonna try it, I'm gonna try it. So here it is. It's, the buckle bit is larger than I thought it was gonna be, but mm, it's okay. They've put the security tag right through the um, right through the whole bit that I need. Oh, that's annoying. This belt you can also get in different colours. I think you can get it in black, maroon, and this kind of cream colour. I don't mind it. I do not mind it. I think I'm go it's difficult to know if it fits though because they've put this tag through and I do, what I do like to do is whenever I've ordered things, I like to try them on in a video 
then when I edit the video back, I get a true sense for whether the piece of clothing actually looks nice or not. And you, isn't that really weird? But it's definitely the case. So many times I used to buy things, I'd be like, yeah, I'm gonna keep it. And I cut all the tags off and I'd edit it. And I'd be like, oh, I don't, I don't like it. And now I've taken all the labels off. So that is something that I tend to do. But let me know what you think. I also think that in the winter, this would look really nice over the top of a blazer. You know, you can get those blazers that are slightly long length. I think that over a blazer would be really nice. I always say this, but whenever I do these videos, the reason why I love them is, you know, when you were like 15, and you'd buy a load of things and then your friend would come over and you'd try them on and you'd be like, what do you think? Yes or no? And I, I really enjoyed that. That, when I was about 15, that bit of the evening was almost more fun than when you got to the actual party itself. And whenever I do these videos, I feel like you're almost in the room with me and I'm like, yes or no? Let me know what you think. All opinions welcome. I always say that, you cannot offend me. Thank you for watching and uh, I'll see you in the next video.